Hey guys, I'm back. I haven't heard from you guys in a long time, so guess what? Steve K is back. Enjoy my intro. Oh, by the way, there's a little message for me. Thanks to you. And now, we're going to do Mr. Meat Story Part 8. Yes. We are going to rescue that young lady once again. <clears throat> and now, I got a shotgun in hand. By the way, they're just sleeping darts in the gun and the uh, uh, tranquilizer gun that we get later. Right now, we're going to open this door. We're going to go through. Yeah, there's some things. We're going to open up that. There's nothing here. Okay, I guess we go through the catwalk. We go push these bricks out of the way. And they updated the game, by the way, which is kind of cool. And everything, so. Now we're going to open up some stuff. Open up the door. And let's see. We're going to move this pizza box out of the way. There's a part of the note. Hmm. We're going to open up these drawers. And, uh. There's some cutting pliers there. I'm gonna open up this. Open up the drawers, trying to grab the wire cutters. Oh, pardon me. Now we got the wire cutters. We're gonna take off the lock, kick the door open. We're going outside. Hey, Mr. Meat, I'm outside. What are you gonna do about it? I'm gonna cut the wires. There, what do you think of that? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, I heard a noise out there. It better not be him. I'm gonna come and get him. Oh, he's over here. Oh. Where are you? I got you? Don't let me out. I'm Mr. Meat. I don't care who you are, Mr. Meat. Every time when Steve K plays with Mr. Meat's house, I get to make a fool out of Mr. Meat. <clears throat> and now, I'm gonna open up the drawers, open up the cabinets. I'm gonna grab this green key. Who knows what this is for? We pull that. <clears throat> There's a little passageway down there. Open up the door. Mr. Meat has to walk all the way around thanks to me putting a lock on. <clears throat> Open up the lock. Grab the wire cutters. As the camera went beep, beep. You know, obviously get Mr. Meat to come and uh, try to get me, which I won't let him do. So... All right, now I cut the wires over there, close the door. I'm going to put the lock on so Mr. Meat can go through that way. You know what we're going to do? We're going to go take this little path. Let's see what's in here. Ah, a piece of wood. I wonder what's inside this piece of wood. Maybe there's something worthwhile. Let's just smash it and see what's inside this piece of wood like the watermelon. We got the blue key. <clears throat> Good. Now that we got the blue key, now we can persist. Yeah, Mr. Meat's like, oh, I heard a noise. Oh. Yeah, good for you. You you ain't hearing nothing. <clears throat> I'm open up this door. Hey, why does he keep making all these noises? He's getting me angry. Oh, oh be quiet, you old man. Don't call me old. Where no one knows my you? age. I keep it that way. Yeah, be quiet. All right. <clears throat> I'm going to close these doors. Put that up. Now. Oh, by the way, guys, please leave comments because I like to create storylines. And if you want me to put your name in a video and create a funny storyline, just let me know. Steve K really listens to his people that do comments on my YouTube channel, and I'm the only one that tries to entertain you guys as much as I can, and I'm very blessed that I could do this day in and day out for you guys, so you guys have a good laugh, and you know, all that good stuff. All right, we're going to put this on here. Oh, wow. <clears throat> we're going to open up some more drawers. Never seen that thing before, but okay. Whoa, a broken roof. Okay. Pliers. We need those. Okay, open this drawer up. That drawer up, and we can open up that drawer. That locked. Open up the drawer. 
All right. <clears throat> Mister Me, go away. Oh, he's over here. I'm coming to get you. I'm taking my sweet time because uh, uh, I'm too tired. Uh, uh. Yeah, you ain't tired. You're not even trying. You're just taking your sweet time trying to get me what you'll never will. Ha ha. All right. I'm going to jump down here in the garage. I'm going to take this lock off, open the door. We know. <clears throat> There's the code we need for later. <coughs> Mr. Meat, meat, meat. That's all that man ever does is eat meat. Then you got Mr. Porky Piggy over there. <coughs> Actually, that's just Mr. Meat's pig, so I'll just call him Piggy. There we go. Open the door. We're going to grab the blue key. We're going to run down here. I got you. Don't worry, young lady. I'm going to save you. I'm going to take the slock off for you. <clears throat> I know you're coming, Mr. Meat. I hear you walking. Go ahead. Go to sleep. <sighs> yeah, now you can go to sleep. Ha, ha, ha. You stay there, meaty meat. Now that I got the tranquilizer going, he's out for 60 seconds because he's sleeping. I'm going to put this... I'm going to see if there's that. We're looking for the wooden heart. I know there's a wooden heart here somewhere. Ooh, gloves. I'll take the gloves. Good. <clears throat> now that we got gloves, we're going to go in Mr. Meat's bathroom. Who knows what's inside that thing? I don't even want to know. Looks very... Oh, that's right. He locked... I locked the door so he wouldn't go that way, so. Yeah, the lock is a new feature, which is I think is kind of nice. Now that we got the glove, we're going to reach inside this yucky stuff. We got the key. Now we're going to go through Mr. Meat's farm. And Mr. Meat's got a science lab down here where... We will do in another video. Right now, our main objective is we're going to save this young lady in the blue. Which is Mr. Meat's daughter. We don't need those players. Get them out of here. Alright. <clears throat> Let's get out of Mr. Meat. Oh, there he goes. Hey, who's making all that noise in the farm? Is that you, Piggy? You. No, it's not me. Leave me alone. I'm hungry. Is Steve K out here? He was. He just went back inside your house. Hey, Piggy. What? Don't give up my spot. What's wrong with you? I don't care. I'm Mr. Meat's pet. Yeah, whatever. Be quiet. All right. Piggy's obviously not on our side. Piggy's not a friend. He's a foe. Okay, we got that noted okay we got a piece of the music box we'll just throw that up there we're going to grab the hammer and now i'm going to take this lock off open these doors and i'm going to break his camera there now you can't track us mr meaty D meat all right <clears throat> Let's see, what do I do? Oh, there he goes. Hey, who broke my camera? That's expensive equipment. Steve K, I know you broke my camera. You're not right for that. Rawr. Yeah, be quiet. I do whatever I want to do, Mr. Meaty D Meat. So, there's uh, the headpiece for... Uh, I think it's a little wind-up music box of a ballerina. So we're going to find out what's what. All right. We're going to go up these stairs. We're going to go into this room. We're going to place it. And now... Oh, 
who knows what's next. I'm gonna just jump out here. All right, let's go to the shed. There. Grab this code. And now we're gonna head back towards the bathroom. Unlock the door first. We're gonna need to throw it there. Now we gotta go find the hammer, which I know is by the farm. <clears throat> I forgot to break the glass, but I'll break the glass eventually. So, let's find this hammer. Where is the hammer? I need the hammer. Hammer. Looking for hammer. So, there's the hammer. Now we can do it. <clears throat> Alright. We're going back to Mr. Meat's bathroom. Sorry, Mr. Meat. Seven years bad luck for you. You're the one who broke the mirror. Ha. Oh. Alright, I'm going to use this code. Now we got the red key. Now that we got the red key, I believe this is the final key. Here goes Mr. Meat. He's like, hey, who broke my mirror? That's seven years of bad luck on me. You're not cool, Stiege. I'm gonna get you with my piece of meat and bone here. <laughs> yeah, be quiet. All right, I'm gonna do this. See, I could free her, but you know what? <clears throat> I want a little sweet taste of payback on Mr. Me because he likes to mess with me. So, <clears throat> with that being said, Mr. Meat, I am calling you out. Yeah, you go that way. I'm going to put you to sleep with a uh, sleeping shotgun with a shotgun cartridge, which is a sleeping bullet. No harm done. He'll go to sleep for a minute and 20 seconds. All right, Meat. I don't know where you're at. But you're coming down here with me. Go to sleep. There. That's what you get for messing with me. And don't you ever badmouth me. Oh, I'm going to sleep. Oh. Hey, it's DK here. I'm here to save you. Come on. Let's get going. You know what, Mr. Meat? Don't you dare mess with us again because Steve K just beat you once again. This is a long travel to get outside and get to the car. Hey, Mr. Mean, I just beat you. See you later. Bye, Mr. Mean. Goodbye. What does he say about it? What does he think? Exactly. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe to Steve K's Notification Squad. And as always, peace out, my dudes. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Bah! I'll be quite meat. Where is he?